Hey guys, it's Tams, a Wiki Witch. Welcome back to the channel. I hope you're all well. We are doing Vlogtober 31 videos leading up to Halloween and Samhain if you're pagan. Um, and today's video is number 20 because it is the 20th of October and it's Thursday and I'm getting the dates right. <laughs> I've got my days and my dates a little bit mixed up the other day, so I apologise for that. So today we've got a witchy haul. I've been to my local witchcraft shop, which is called White Witch. And um, yeah, been popped in and got a few bits. I got a few bits from somewhere else. So you might have seen a couple of these bits, but I thought I'd still show you. Because I actually got them reduced and bought some more. I was back up. So I'm going to show you those bits first. They reduced these. In my TK Maxx, they reduced these scented pumpkins with the autumn um, cinnamon pumpkin spice smell. It's like potpourri, but it's all like little dried. It's also got acorns and stuff and, um, you know, that kind of stuff inside. I can't think what they're called. Acorns. No, they're not called acorns. What are they called? Pine cones. Oh, my God. <laughs> <laughs> and a bit mental block all that kind of stuff and it's all scented so you pierce the top and you can smell it now these have been reduced in my tk max so yeah they were five or six pound i think and they've been reduced to three pound fifty so i bought another one of those i have shown you this already and i also bought another one of these autumn pumpkin cheesecake candles now it is potent pumpkin spice smell these were seven pounds and I got this for three pound 99 and I just literally loved I love this bit it's so cute and I actually just got another one because these smell these aren't as potent when you burn them and I do like that because they're a bit strong but yeah very nice so I've got that um I also got in Tesco's it's got all squirrels and leaves and acorns around it Apologies for the nails. They've all broke off and they're all chipped. They look hideous. Sorry, I am at work. I'm working from home today, so I haven't done my nails. Nothing. Been so busy this week. Yeah, sorry. Um, squirrel. Hmm. Pump, pumpkin, cinnamon. Yeah, got like a nice green top. That one sits there for the minute. And this one, I bought my mum this one. This one's got foxes and moons and trees and foxes. And this one smells like cherry. Cherry or black? I'm going to go with black currant. Black currant for this one. I bought my mum this one because my mum's got foxes that come up and come in the house and everything. So, um, And I bought her a fox one. So they was really cute. They're out of um, Tesco's. And uh, I know you saw my skulls that I got off of eBay. I showed you these the other day. But again, I just thought I'd show you them. Um, this is some sort of malachite, we think. That is rose, um, this is angelite, angelite this is, and it looks like an alien skull. I had to think them. I bought that as a rose quartz one, but it actually isn't. It's angelite, and you can see the blue in it today. You couldn't see it the other day. So that's angelite, and this is a malachite, but yeah, they're for the altar. Really cool. And you'll see this in my, my Halloween haul at the end of the week. But I went to a Halloween haunt shop, and you can see it it was yesterday's video yes it was yesterday's video i went to a halloween haunt shop the day before and um i got this in there and it's just very fitting fortune teller knows all and tells all well you know i'm very bossy i do know all and tell all so yeah i just thought this was really cool it actually hangs on like a little scroll so i might hang that in the porch just to let people know that there's bossiness in this house no, I just thought that was really cute. It was only 2 99 It's only like soft. But yeah, just thought that was a bit of fun. So anyway, let's get my little woo bag out. I'm so excited. So, I bought the Witch's Date Book for 2023. So I always get my mum one um, for your and Christmas. So I picked up a couple. She'll probably watch this and know what I've got. But I usually pick her one up because it's just brilliant. It's got everything in it. All your moons, all your dates, all the things you want. Little ideas for spells. They're just lovely. So it's a Llewellyn, which is date books. I did actually get two. But obviously this one's mine. So that's that. And I 
bought a couple of cards. Now, I bought this card. It's a witch on her door with her Halloween pumpkins. This is going to be very hard to show. Can you see? I think it's a, it's a Wendy Andrews, but I actually bought this to put in a frame in the hallway. I just thought it was so cute. Little witchy lady with the cat. And she's got her pumpkins and it's supposed to be sour and she's out in the in the October in the October dark night with her pumpkins alight. Just thought it's cute. I love Wendy Andrews. So I bought that. And I also bought this, which is a owl in flight. And this is a winter night fright. They're Helen White um paintings from photos, I think. Just thought that was so cute. One of my spirit animals is a barn owl and this just was very fitting. I won't go into it, but just the way he's flying. Um, I bought that and they're actually going in frames. So I do that quite a lot. I buy cards, pagan cards, and put them in frames. Um, I had to get a new air freshener for the car because my car smells um, very musty because I've had a lot of... <laughs> I had to put stock in it the other day and take it to one of my sites because we couldn't get a delivery in there. So it smells a bit musty. So I just got an air freshener. They're only a pound. And um, it says my other my other ride is a broom. And it smells a little bit fruity. So that'll make the car smell better. I needed a... Um, I needed a new coaster. For the side of my chair to stand my drinks on. It's too pretty really to use. It's an Alchemy England make. And it's got a witch on the front. I just thought it was quite cute. But to be honest, it's too pretty to stand your drinks on. But I am going to. Just thought that was really cute. I got that. I love going in there. And having a chat with the lady who owns it. Her name's Debbie. And she's lovely. I've known her for years. I went in there in 1999 when it first opened. I've been going in there ever since. Because we had nothing like that around our way. So it was super cool. Um, she's lovely. She's a wonderful, wonderful person could talk to her for hours um oh i picked up i picked up myself a handmade new sage this is california sage but it's got lavender with it and i really enjoyed using this last time so i got myself a lovely new sage smudge so that's good and then i fancied some new incense but i'm very funny with incense because if they're soapy they make me feel like i'm going to be sick if they're too strong, they give me a headache. If they're too weak, they remind me of old wood burning. And I, I, so I'm really, really funny. And because Chacha Dum Dum did away with their um, Tree of Life incense, and as you know, I was a massive Shalimar fan. I miss it so much. The nearest smell I could get to that Shalimar, um, excuse me, I'm adjusting my cotton wool, um, was um, Pagan Spell. Pagan spell incense, not when you smell it in the box, it smells a bit soapy, but when you light it, it smells a little bit like Shalimar. So I'm always on the hunt for some other smells because, you know, I really like the Tree of Life ones and I'm really fussy with incense. Anyway, I have found a couple, but today I found this protection incense and it's um, made by, who's it made by? New Moon Aromas, right? It's got the Hamza hand on the front, it's protection. This smells like one of the designer men's aftershaves with a hint of sandalwood. This smells like, I think I'll like this because I'm so fussy. I will like that. I also got sacred wood. I know I just said I don't like the smell of old wood burning, but I meant old wood when people light it up and it's damp and that and stinks. This smells good. This has got, this is like sandalwood with like some kind of mellow, earthy, I'm excited about that. So this is made by, oh, it's a new moon as well. Sacred wood. I got some, um, so this make is golden nag, or golden na, because nachamba. They, it's written nag champa, but you pronounce it nachamba. I think it's one of the makes that makes that as well. Um, this is patchouli. Agrabaffy. All right, these are made by... I can't even pronounce it. I'll show you it. It's on the side. These are made by that. Don't know what that says. This smells good. Patchouli, but with a hint of leaves. I like that. So far, we're doing good. And I also got a dragon's blood. Now, again, Tree of Life, dragon's blood. I used it for my Morrigan rituals and my Morrigan stuff. 
she absolutely loves blood blood um dragon's blood um incense and i haven't really found one that matched it this is all right you can smell which dragon's blood but a bit of a soapy hint but i wanted to get some for Samhain, so we've got some dragon's blood and i bought a couple of books now i don't buy books that often at the minute because um I usually get books off of eBay, but when I go in the shop, I do like to buy a brand new book. I do usually buy them secondhand off of eBay. So this book is called The Twelve Faces of the Goddess by Danielle Blackwood. And it is a brand new book. It goes through the discovery of the goddess in birth, chart, and um, in authenticity, passion, and purpose. I don't know, just body, mind, spirit, astrology, and goddess worship. Goddess worship. Just fancy something a little bit different, something a little bit relaxing because my job at the minute is extremely stressful and, you know, something you can chill out with. And I also bought Advanced Psychic Development by Becky Walsh. Um, I have a lot of psychic development books and I can't read the back, it's too small. My glasses have got hairspray all over them, <laughs> so I'm not even going to attempt it. But I'll let you know how these go. Now, somebody asked me, I bought Poppets and... Poppets and Poppets and Dolls book and I can't remember the lovely lady's name and she asked me to do a review I reckon it was about three months ago on this book now I'm going to do a review of these and a review of that after we've got these 31 videos out of the way I'll let you know because I'll be reading these um by then and I will have read the other one because I haven't read it yet um it's actually sitting on the side I'm absolutely terrible I get so sidetracked with work and then I forget what I'm doing but I will definitely do your review of the Poppets um, Pagan Portals book. It's only a little book because um, I'm so excited to read it. I just haven't read it yet. Terrible. Um, so, yeah, I hope you like my little haul from the witch shop. Um, I enjoyed shopping there. Very nice. Please like, please subscribe. Um, I've lost track of what I was doing. Do you notice how I just wander off? My brain is terrible. Please like, please subscribe. Thank you to the new subscribers. I've got another six people. I was so pleased. Thank you. Um, tomorrow's video is going to be the rest of the dolls um, that I made. Another little musical, you know, just photos. It's all I have. I have to film it off the telly. It's a bit pony, I know, but that will be tomorrow's video. I'll probably put it out tonight because Fridays is really busy um, for me trying to get the week to end um and everything shut down for the week so i will probably put that out this evening um so it's already out for you guys and then over the weekend i'm going to try and do something else um you know just to liven them up i know it's all been a bit horror related um and as we approach next week i'll try and do some more witchy stuff and some spells and things so hope you're enjoying watching them all um please like please subscribe see you all soon see you tomorrow see you later on Ta -da!